Hey everyone, Eric here, and I'm gonna show you how to hook up your Magic Light Wi-Fi bulb to your home router. So you can control it through your smartphone. So first, let's go ahead and plug it into the socket. And now let's go to our device. We're going to go to the App Store. So I have a Android device. I'm gonna to go to the Play Store and search for Magic Light WF. There it is right there. Go ahead and install. And while that's installing, you can go ahead and now that the bulb is on, it should start broadcasting a Wi-Fi signal that we wanna to connect to. So to connect to it, you have to first make sure that your Wi-Fi is on and enabled. And then what you wanna do is look for LED net and then there'll be a series of numbers and letters. So there it is right there. So let's go ahead and connect. So obtaining the IP address and now it's connected. So now we can go back, let's see. Okay, it's finished downloaded. Let's go ahead and open the app. And now there's a couple different ways you can connect to the bulb. You can do a direct connect where the device is talking straight to the, um, to the bulb instead of going through the router. So right now we can go ahead and uh, see all the different functions of the bulb. So you change the color. Um, but what I recommend doing is setting up the bulb to talk to the router. And I'm gonna show you how to do that. So what you wanna do is go back and then let's go ahead and go to our settings. Click on your device. And now your device is gonna search for open routers in your area. So let's go ahead and link to wireless. And this is my signal right here, uh, Galactic Empire, which is 2.4 gigahertz. Right here is Starkiller Base. That's a five gigahertz range. Now it's very important. If you guys have a dual band router, you wanna make sure to connect to the 2.4 gigahertz range because that's the only one that the uh, Magic Light will work with. So let's go ahead and connect to that. And this is very important. You wanna make sure and enter the correct password for your router. If you do get it wrong, sometimes it's not gonna tell you that you entered the wrong um, password and you're gonna lose the connection with the bulb and then you're gonna have to uh, reset it. So let's go ahead and enter the password. So once you enter, it's gonna go ahead and reset. And if you do enter the wrong password or for some reason it's not working, um, you, you're not able to get to this step, you're gonna perform a factory reset on the bulb. Okay, so now my uh, setup's complete. So it's gonna scan for the devices. And if your bulb didn't immediately pull up, go ahead and shut down the app and then open it again. So remember, I just connected the bulb to my router and I entered my router's password and here it is right here. So now my device is talking to the router and then it's talking to the bulb. So now I have full control over it again. And then the third way you can do it is to create a Magic Light account. The great thing about doing it this way is you can actually control the bulb no matter where you're at as long as, you, um, as long as your home router is still on and your bulb's still on. So to set up for an account, you go to your settings, your little gearbox up at the top, and then let's go ahead and sign in or register. And I need to create an account. Go ahead and enter your email and then go ahead and sign in with the account details that you just entered. Okay, and now your account is all set up. And here's my device. If you wanted to change the name, let's say you have a, a bulb like in your bedroom, a bulb in the bathroom, you can go ahead and um, name the bulbs as well, right here, device name. So let's say bedroom. And all your bulbs are gonna list right here. If you are having problems with your bulb uh, not showing up on your device, there's a couple things you can do. Shut down the app, restart it, and then another thing is to factory reset it. So to factory reset it, you basically, you just turn your bulb off, turn it back on, count to five. Do this a total of four times. After the fourth time, you'll see your bulb start flashing just like this. 